Ooh, team here. <laughs> hey, man. I feel like playing some more of it. Pokemon? <laughs> Card game. Heck yeah, man. Well, let's just get right into it, guys. So, all I'm going to do is tweet out that I'm live here. To, uh, going to quickly get into it. Um, Yeah, I don't really have too much to update in terms of... uh. Yeah, usually each stream I'll, you know, because this is the first stream of the day, and usually each one I'll just kind of be like, oh, hey, this is what we're doing on YouTube. This, I mean, I mean, really, it's kind of the same thing as last week. I mean, I will tell you guys, uh, we're gonna be a little do a little bit of BTS today behind the scenes, or um, is it Dawn of Destiny or Decades Duel? It's something on the Xbox. Okay, <laughs> like I forget what exactly we're supposed. to to do you know for a dueling marathon today that'll be posted you know what i mean and this will be posted around yeah, right when the kids get out of school like around at 3 30 you know wisconsin time so yeah another dueling marathon it's probably donna destiny if i'm being um uh, but i had to basically like look at my uh uh channel on youtube and just Basically, that's how I do it, right? Which one was posted last? Okay, either 5Ds or, you know, it, it's one or the other, you know. So, that's the plan with that. Um, also, there is one other thing. Um, I definitely, and I hate to say this, but, um, yes. Yeah, so, as you guys know, um, Thanksgiving is coming up soon. Thanksgiving here in America is always the third Thursday of the month. And here's the problem. <laughs> By problem, I mean problem. Yes, yeah, so it's not actually a problem. It's just reality. Okay, guys. There ain't going to be no Thanksgiving streams, man. You know, I, I mean, I'll try to work. Man, it, it's going to be loud around here. We're going to have all kind of people. Like, as a matter of fact, my streams are already, like, interrupted. Enough as it is, you know, you, you guys know what I mean, like, especially if you've seen, like, some of the weekend streams or whatever, or, like, hey, man, there's just a lot going on around here, okay? <laughs> we got, uh, how many people we got living in the house? I might as well count Diego, because he's always over here, so, if I count Diego, we got, like, ten people in this house, okay? <laughs> you know, uh, after, after school, you know, from 3.30 onward, so, you know. Yeah, man, and Thanksgiving is only going to increase the numbers. Also, some people are coming early, so, you know, can I convince all of them to shut the up? No, no, I mean, <laughs> there's one thing I know about my family. It's that we all love to talk so and yell and just kind of wild. And, I mean, for some, you have to understand, for some of my lovely uh, family members, I mean, they're they basically treat it as vacation, which, hey, I mean, it basically is, right? And speaking of vacation, like, um, I think at one point some of us, I mean, the talks are still in the works, in the works, in the works. So, again, nothing's confirmed yet. I'm pretty sure at least two families are coming here, uh, you know, and you guys know I have um, five sisters, so and they all got kids, man, so. Yeah, well, only one of them doesn't have kids. But, I mean, she's got, like, company, you know. <laughs> she's got, like, a group of friends and uh, also a boyfriend who, yeah, yeah. So, basically, they all got somebody. They bring him with them. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> um, also, you know, yeah. So, yeah. Um, yeah, just be ready for that, man. You know, I mean, I, I, I can't say it any other way. Just be ready for me to like disappear <laughs> you know off of youtube and off of uh well i guess youtube i should be able to um make some uh make some you know edits you know i have been working on one or two thanksgiving specials and they involve pumpkin right pumpkin the king of ghosts because uh, i do have a save file over there that is a pumpkin save file so that's gonna be there's gonna be a pumpkin like and like a three hour stream VOD on um YouTube on Thanksgiving. You know, cause that just makes sense, you know. You make a pumpkin turbo deck and you just kinda Yeah, I mean, nothing says Thanksgiving like pumpkin pie. So there you go. I mean, I guess that's coming up. Um 
Yeah, but just know, like, I there's a good chance I might not stream for five days in a row. Yeah, I, I mean, like, you know, I'll try to squeeze in some time. You know, of course, here's the hardest part, right? <laughs> Is normally I try to squeeze in time overnight. You know, that's the plan when we got a lot of people. Here's the problem. Like, the kids ain't got to go to school. Uh, that no one has to go to work. Um, they're here, you know what I mean? And usually we will kind of play like family games, like up till like two in the morning. So not to mention like it's loud during the day. It's hard for me to get some sleep, you know, mentally, usually when everyone's here. So, and I don't like to stream when I'm too bitter. <laughs> well, maybe I do remember that Marvel rant yesterday, <laughs> but, um, no, nah, like that's the reality, man, is I probably just, you know, We'll just cut my losses and, you know, but it's weird because like on Twitch, you know, Thanksgiving is one of the best times to stream because, yeah, you get an audience that, you know, for example, let's face facts, my audience, my core audience, and I can just tell you guys based on the number on YouTube, my core audience is what males, you know, aged 11 to 40 on YouTube. You know, because, it, and it's just like, hey, man, when I was a kid, when I was a teen in, in junior high, I used to play, that's that's when I had the most passion for Yu-Gi-Oh! And that's that's an understandable demographic. Like, 3% female, 97% male, <laughs> you know, aged, you know, 11 to 40. So, what's weird is I actually have a potential audience, like, increase. Because, like, all the kids will be out of school for... Thanksgiving as well, you know, like worldwide. So what's weird is I really, 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 really want to stream, you know, because the audience is there and the audience is not only there, it's increased. But the reality is, is like, hey, man, you know, it's probably going to be now, now there is a chance some people sleep in until 10. So, you know, you know what I mean? Maybe my ideal hours are excuse me my ideal streaming hours you know during thanksgiving week maybe like six in the morning to ten you know i could see like five people being up but you know most likely people are going to be knocking on the door uncle joji what you doing you know they're just going to want to waltz in here and make some noise okay i mean I, that's you know now can i handle five people yeah can i handle 20 people interrupting? No. So, <laughs> you know, and I'm pretty sure, like, none of them want to be on camera. Like, that, like that's the thing, man. It's like, you guys should know that about me. Um, I never film people who want to be on camera, you know, audio or video. It's just like, if they, and like, 99% of the people out here on the planet will tell you, hey, I don't want to be on camera. I don't want to be on audio. I don't want to be on video. And that's, I respect them, okay? You know, so... Yeah, uh, one thing I am going to try to do is make a giant sign, which, much like Yu-Gi-Oh! players, my family can't read. <laughs> hey, that's, that's, that's a Tim, uh, clip that one. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> there should be, I should make that a t-shirt. Oh, man, I should make that a, uh, that should be like my brand t-shirt. It's just like, it just says right here, you know, much like Yu-Gi-Oh! players, my family can't read. And then you just put like, <laughs> you put like a pendulum monster on the back. <laughs> With a, you put a, a Nirvana, a Nirvana High Paladin on the back. <laughs> and you just literally put the text box of a Nirvana High Paladin on the back. <laughs> That'd be funny. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, what's up, Camilla? Uh, yeah, uh, not not much going on here. I'm just kind of rambling, and uh, well, what I'm doing is I'm actually covertly setting stuff up in the background, but I'm updating you guys on the fact that I probably won't stream Thanksgiving with I mean, as much as I want to. Um, it's just a very unrealistic. This house is going to be loaded, man. This house is going to be loaded. You know, uh, great. Uh, hey, uh, Camilla. Um, do you expect a lot of people for Thanksgiving? Like, do you have a big family? Because that's kind of what I'm talking about here. It's like, whew, man, next week it's going to be loaded, man. And Thanksgiving is coming quick. Oh, hey, by the way, guys, uh, you YouTube VOD watchers, same for Christmas. Same for Christmas. It's going to be loaded. 
I, I doubt I'll be able to stream. Like I said, the audience is there. I really want to stream, but, you know, yeah, it's going to be just jam-packed here. <laughs> you know, so, yeah. Crazy, man. Crazy. But, uh, yeah, how's your day going, Camellia? Uh, hope you're uh, doing good. Maybe you just got off work or whatever, but, yeah. Uh, it's uh, it's going to be rough around here, man. It's going to be just, yeah. <laughs> That's good. That's good. Yeah, um, other updates. Um, so, uh, you know, um, other updates like, oh, yeah, Nightmare Troubadour. No, no, I mean um, Pokemon Nightmare Invasion. Yeah. <laughs> so um, I actually wanted to let you guys know for Pokemon Nightmare Invasion, like I actually had a failed recording. Um. Yeah, I had someone let me borrow their phone, and yeah, we recorded and everything, and I don't know what happened. For some reason, there was no audio. <laughs> I mean, luckily, I spaced out the save files, so well, that's good, but for some reason, like, there was no audio, Uh, you know, because obviously, I wanted to keep Nightmare version Invasion going, but um, uh, tw yeah, uh, here's my Twitter, but um, <laughs> digital artist ah um hey oh yeah by the way i'm meeting today with a friend who um it actually she has her degree you know locally in uh wisconsin and she does art so uh yeah we're gonna uh we're gonna take care of some stuff here um, and she says she's willing to give me a homie drop too. So that's, that's actually really good. <laughs> yeah. Cause that way, uh, yeah, but, um, Hey, that's awesome. I mean, I, uh, I respect artists. They are quite the talented, uh, I can only draw stick figures, man. But, uh, yeah, that's, that's awesome. Um, but yeah, she's supposed to be doing some channel artwork for me and Hey, you know, it may take, she said, it may take some time, but she's going to get it going for me. So that's pretty cool. Pretty cool. So that way I can just tell everybody, eh, you know, I don't really need anything. Hey, it's already in the works. You know, so. But uh, yeah, art is cool. But yeah, hey, if you want to share some of your art on my Twitter or uh, send it to me, yeah, I'll take a look at it, honestly, because uh, <laughs> I'll be honest, I just like looking at art. You know what I mean? Like the fact that I am I'm only stuck on stick figures, uh, it makes me appreciate art way more. And uh the main game I play, Yu-Gi-Oh. Right. Like there's a ton of just amazing art <laughs> that I couldn't even dream to draw. So uh yeah, that's pretty the world. Hang on. Uh, that's hmm. Hmm. Huh. Um. Oh yeah. I mean, you could show. Yeah, you can. Uh. Your... Anything. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah, if you want to just kind of show me what you're working with, that's cool. Uh, let's see here. That's weird. What in the world? <laughs> My computer is doing like the weirdest thing right now. Hang on, man. I may actually have to restart stream. What the hell? Things like freaking out. Um. By the way, uh, I don't know, Camille. Can you still see the my computer? Oh, okay. To describe what my computer's doing, you know, the blue screen of death. It's kind of like that, but it's like it's like blue and purple. What the f world? 
Uh, I'm getting a little worried here, guys. Hang on. Um, uh, you know, I was, I did have a, you know, as always, <laughs> I got some uh, YouTube uh, VODs uploading in the background, so maybe that's what it is. I don't know. I mean, I, this is bad, man. <laughs> This looks pretty, uh, um, let me see if I can fix this. Hang Let's on. close the yeah. YouTube um, premium, uh, whatever. Yeah. And let's go to my Twitch studio. Uh, uh, oh, okay. Okay. Oof. Okay. I think I closed the right tab guys. Hang on. Hang on. Let me, uh, okay. That was a little scary. Not going to lie. That was a little weird um let me close some stuff here uh <laughs> whoa <laughs> okay that uh hmm that is a little scary yes um whoa dude um hmm yeah this thing i think i need more ram um, in this, uh, well, no, what it is, is this laptop is, yeah, it's, it's like four or five years old, man. It's, uh, it's struggling lately. Um, yeah, it kind of is, so, um, okay. And, oh, let's see what, um, yeah, because I'm sure they, oh, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, that's, uh, I guess I can open my Twitter, because I recommended you share over there. <laughs> you know, normally I don't keep my Twitter on, uh, open on stream, because, uh, and Twitter's wild, bro, can I just say that? <laughs> like, Twitter's like the wild, wild west out here, bro, and you ever get something in your recommended that's, like, just really, uh, <laughs> you know, I, hey, maybe some of you guys keep your Twitter clean, but, uh, I mean, you ever just get something recommended that's like 18 plus, you know what I mean? And it's clearly like, it's stuff I don't want to show on stream. <laughs> like, I mean, you know, anyway, I mean, I think we all know that Twitter is, it's pretty wild these days. It's crazy. It's, uh, yeah, I mean, this is definitely not the, the site to talk about it or the space or the place, but at some point, uh, Tim, remind me um you know we can have an 18 plus stream at some point where it's literally 18 plus and there are some things i have to say about twitter and just the general direction of uh of a uh, civilization modern civilization that uh you know some people might not agree with which means it's the perfect thing to say right tim but I'll have to do, uh, you, you know how in the Marvel rant, I <laughs> I was very vague when covering, you know, social agenda and blah, 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 blah. You know, I, I was like social agenda 34D underscore DC slash BDFEG, you know? <laughs> you know, you remember how I was very vague, Tim? Like, yeah, bro. <laughs> Same for this discussion. Uh, you like, Tim, I think, you know, it's the discussion I've been wanting to have. For like forever but uh timing is everything right and also we definitely want to make sure the chat's 18 plus <laughs> all right so let's go to my twitter um she uh yeah someone should have tried to message me or uh uh well maybe camellia will uh send the art over there but uh yeah uh anyway let me uh do this uh Uh, there we go guys that is the uh pinning the message for pokemon trading card game <laughs> i just uh t i'll just be straight up honest with you guys i basically took a random episode out of the playlist and just <laughs> kind of linked it right there um yeah and uh i hide for myself okay all right, there we go. That's pinned. And next, uh, 
Oh, oh, Candy's online. You know what? I'm going to go say hi to Candy real quick. So He's cool, man. Can't be too mad at Candy. <laughs> We've rated her a couple Get twiggy. times, as I'm sure you guys know. So You know why? Because your shit wasn't distracting enough that I couldn't read one message and remember what I was saying. So, uh. <laughs> Hi, Flooden. Hey, thank you for sending me that shit. I appreciated it. <laughs> it's good. It's good. We're doing just dance today. Heads up. We might be bringing back Yu-Gi-Oh! Sunday, though, because uh, I fucking love Yu-Gi-Oh! And I liked Yu-Gi-Oh! Sunday, yeah. and they were nice. So at some point on Sundays, we might be doing Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> All right. Well, I just wanted to say hi right there. Um, well, anyway, let's, uh, da -da 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 here, and there we go, um, let's see, did you, do, do, um, yeah, like I said, I guess I'll keep, keep my Twitter open, even though I prefer not to, <laughs> um, oh, I should mute back, oh, yeah, <laughs> I know what I'm doing today. I'm I'm on the ball. Hey Tim, Tim, I'm on the ball today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was just talking about how, I, <laughs> you know, I I probably shouldn't broadcast my Twitter, but uh, yeah, uh, you know what, Tim, I'll write that one down. I I will write down the uh, the discussion, <laughs> aka rant of modern Twitter, and my thoughts about it. Because I have several thoughts about. Also, I guess in the middle of that discussion, Tim, we could cover Elon Musk and his. The strangest business move I have ever seen. You know, to get rid of the bird. But we can talk about that, you know, because I have something to say about branding and recognition. And. Why you want the head, you got to be careful who you let be the head of your company. You really do. You really do. So that's that's like two separate rants. And uh, I think we can cover the burb one on, um, like, you know what I mean? Like, even today, during a Master Duel stream. I mean, not right now. I don't want to throw off the flow of the stream. But at some point, <laughs> you know, I could just talk about, you know, that, Tim. I, 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 I could. Because it's a worthwhile discussion. But anyway. <laughs> Let's go. You may hear some music in the background. In fact, I hope you do hear some music. Because this is let's play the Pokemon trading card game. So there we go. And there we go. Alright guys, here we go. <laughs> Alright. Last time on Pokemon Trading Card Game, we defeated all the Fighting Club members of Mitch's Club. We brought them all here, and now it's time to see if we can defeat the Club Master himself, Mitch. All right, of the Fighting Club. All right, over here is the club. They got the boxing ring. They got the key. They got the weights. Let's talk to Mitch, shall we? Oh, so we have all of my tools. Let's see if you have what it takes to endure. The legendary Pokemon card. Okay, are you ready, land lover? I don't know why I gave this to make us zombie but it is. Would you like to go, Mitch? Yeah, buddy. Come on, show me what you got. We'll play with six fight. And it's Mitch. First strike deck. Listen to this music. Oh yeah. For those of you on Twitch who haven't heard the Club Master uh, battle music, there you go. And this is some of the best music in the game. Bad start for us. Look at how you change the game. That won't make it work. The good part is, these things do have really high HP, so, you know, should be able to stall for a while. Also, we only got him on the which, uh, yeah, I guess it can one shot like a ton, but, uh, yeah, we'll just try to paralyze him at the same time. Oh, he's not even building up to the moment. Okay, 
this gives us a better chance than I thought. Um, yeah, let's just start with Tongue Wrath. I mean, there's no reason not to. Damage. Paralysis. Good. Uh, but yeah, we may want to draw a Fire Pokemon as soon as possible. Because, uh, yeah, let me show this thing. Yeah, High Jump Kick. Pure 50. Three for 50. It's not good for us. Yeah. <laughs> also, yeah, you know, you don't need to get much in it. You guys have seen this in my deck. Um, a strategy I could actually go with is the confusion on Lickitung. Kind of an interesting thought. Tell you what, I will go for confusion or build up um chancy. That's the question here. I guess I'll go for the confusion actually. Normally I would never do this, but I don't know. No, this one leaves confused, which could be good, could be bad, I don't know. Okay, so he's going on, oh, so he's looking at his price of stretch kick, and he got a three, so he can't see tips. Okay, so there's that, um, I guess, well, that's the thing, paralysis replaces confusion. Huh. Well, what this comes down to is, do I think the next point flip is going to be hit or tail? You know, I've gotten a lot of hits to start. I feel like it should be good. Let's just hit that. Kind of a weird decision, but you guys will see what I'm talking about. Um, if you get to the attack through, I guess bad move by me. I don't know. Wow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I had the chance to paralyze there with the Tongue Wrap, and I failed to do so. So, alright. Tempty is now here. So, one hit from High Jump Kick will knock us out. So, our strategy actually to uh, Oh, we failed. No. The game can be over really quickly, so all comes down to coins and miss it through. Wow. There you go. Oh, that's the game. We just had some bad luck. <laughs> Drawing some colorless Pokemon. In fact, I think these are our only two colorless in the deck. Yeah, we also never threw much of a top. You may have been able to defeat my people, but you are still not experienced enough. Come back after you train more. Okay, I've trained more. Yeah, yeah, no, no. <laughs> I just fight him right away, right again, because, uh, yeah, why not? You know, <laughs> yeah, look at that, Mitch. I trained more. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I went through an entire tuning and training arc, bro. Now I'm ready. Uh, oh, look, the fire Pokemon. Okay, this duel should be different already. Not all is different in two ways. Number one, we don't have much Pokemon. Number two, I doubt they'll start with them on the game. And most of the time, it's... E oh! And most of the time, he'll start with Hitmon Chain. So, the fact that he's starting with Lee twice in a row... Alright, so we'll build this. Another fire on Charmander. And we have some Uber Surge, which means the tool's gonna be pretty good. Now, normally I'd be worried to hit my chain hit on these being built up. But actually, I'm not, because yeah, <laughs> you know, his attack that he used last time, Stretch Kick, it only hits bitch Pokemon, so. Good thing for us. So, what we'll do here is let's spin the deck with some Peter Surge on fire. Okay. Put the fire to Charmander. And we're going to use good old flames over here, so... Yeah, let's get rid of some of this. Also, we never drew Zapdos. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, speaking of Zapdos. <laughs> yeah, we never drew Zapdos last school either, which definitely would have been clutch. Um, yeah, by the way, Zapdos is this fighting. So, yeah, because it's both immune to the ground and fighting. So, which makes sense. Now he's down to just Minky, and... If we just like to see him, who hits? Uh, well, I guess Charmander get a couple turns, but yeah. Okay, guys. Yeah. Great training arc, bro. <laughs> what just happened there? Oh, Mitch. Dog. That's embarrassing. Well, I guess it's embarrassing that I lost first, but... Easiest club master battle ever. Wonderful. Great match. Very good. Dude, that, that, that was like both hot and cold. Like, he got swept, then he got swept. So, yeah, whatever though, we got the master medal.
Yo, we the other one, the fighting medal. Here, take this. It's a lot more than where you should have. Not anything good. Well, we could take a playable out of here. All? Oh, 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 oh. And this card's cool. Check it out, transparency. Whatever an attack is paid, it is the hotter. If it permits all effects of that attack, then the hotter is found out for people. Well, hotter is a sleep. And nightmare auto sleep. Super thin. Good. That's a pretty cool description. Also, Mac Mark. Freezing me! And, or, see, I'd like to see the trip. I don't know. See, the has a deal with it. about those duels. Those duels will be weird. I can see that. I mean, let's go with the bold one, right? And, yeah, let's go, uh, a gambler here. I don't know. Yeah, those duels were pretty, uh... I mean, they were both so weird because, like, one was, you know, straightforward and the other was like, what? Also, let's go another gambler and fight Splash here. Um, yeah, let's go a gambler. Gambler's like a bad version of Professor Oak, but it's better than some of the pink stuff we've had here. Uh, let's just get rid of a, uh, um, um, and I love the lineup I have in there. Oh, also, that is a lot better than the one we had. Yeah, this transparency one, I love this one so much more than the Dream Eater one. Um, so let's just put the Dream Eater one in there. Let's go with this on there. Yeah, that's... That's good. We still got the good Gastly, right? This Gastly... Yeah, this thing bond is... You can make the AI fall for this thing bond, but... I don't want to do it. So. Um, yeah, I definitely like that. That's cool. Also, we could consider Hypno. I mean, it is... It is good, yeah. Um... Um... Let me see here. But I do want to at least show Mr. Mime and Jinx a little more. And me too, if I can just show me too. So... Yeah, we'll leave it as is. Eventually, I will flex into the hit one at some point because it's just too good not to show. Um, I guess it's a bit of a club as well. I'm going to do that next week. And you can go with a bold door. Alright, Mitch. Uh, no items. Final destination. You wish to meet the fighting club master again? Yeah, bro. I mean, you won one clearly. I won one clearly. I just want a nice, clean match where we have all six prizes, bro. Alright, let's do it. <laughs> First, I'm going to take a little drink of water here. Make sure everything's good on stream, too. Um. <laughs> oh, it's Sir. Hey, hey. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Well, hey, what's up, Sir? <laughs> it's <laughs> check on the back. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> also, the game is... Oh, here appreciate you sir you're the man um two things i just woke up maybe i need to speak up also i'm pretty sure i could told me this as well you know what the game volume is at right now it's at one <laughs> the game volume's at one bro so yeah i uh <laughs> on my mixer maybe i can do something here hmm. Mm. Now nah, that's as low as I can go, bro. Maybe I can lower the hertz. I don't know. <laughs> um, 
Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm going to just have to try speaking up, sir. Sorry, you know, <laughs> that's just the way it goes. Um, Wait a sec, let me. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, good to see you, bro. But uh, yeah, anyway, round three. Round three. Fight. Finish him. Yeah, so uh, we uh, started by doing the club master battle. Mitch swept us, then we swept him. So it's like a tiebreaker match right here. But uh, yeah, <laughs> what are you up to today, sir? Hope you're doing good. Thanks for being here. Ah, this is the usual start he has, my chop. So <laughs> he started with Hitmonlee twice in a row, which is very odd. But um, you know, anyway, <laughs> we got a build. Ooh, bad luck here. No fighting energy. Uh, I don't like we passed. <laughs> Not much going on here. All right, well, uh, did it, did, 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 have you ever played the, uh, wait, what, what'd you say, sir? Um, do, do, do. oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes, uh, I did way back, <laughs> um, Yeah, so those are the years I played uh, Pokemon TCG. Um, not very long. Um, one of my favorite decks was... Um, yeah, it was like a Jod... Oh, that's a hell of a draw right here. That's a hell of a draw, because then we have... Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, let's just end the turn here. Yeah, Mitch, yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, don't evolve that thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> Oh man, we're cooking now, sir. We're cooking now. All right, all right. And uh, out of an abundance of caution, let's just do this. And uh, yeah, <laughs> you know, suddenly this duel's looking up. You know, I, it wasn't looking too good, but uh, suddenly this, yeah, yeah. Um, I guess that's my question. You know, uh, how about you? <laughs> Ever play? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. There we go. Do, 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 do. Okay, Machop. Oh, don't evolve, don't evolve. Okay, thank God. Yeah, if he evolved to Machoke there, we may have had some problems. But uh, anyway, do gong 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 gong. All right. <laughs> All right, and we'll put the energy on Dugong and Aurora. See ya. <laughs> oh, the flush those three energy down the drain, Mitch. <laughs> oh, by the way, I never pointed this out, but like. You see how, like, when Mitch has his picture, there's, like, a uh, fighting rink in the background as well? That's kind of, you know, <laughs> it's kind of cool or whatever. Uh, man, Machop for days. Uh, I guess we'll put another. No, 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 I'm not going to put another one on the bench. I don't want to clog my bench, yo. All right, taste my Aurora Beam, man. <laughs> oh, man, it feels so good. Dugong is... Okay, there's a fighting energy. There we go. Okay, Hitmon Lee normally would be a problem, but <laughs> we've got two plus powers in hand. And are you out of Pokemon? No, okay. Well, anyway, obviously we go with plus power here to overpower the, um, yeah. <laughs> and we stick a fresh Machop down, fighting energy on that. And see ya. <laughs> oh, Mitch, man, you're getting, like, pwned, bro. You're getting pwned. <laughs> uh, uh, hey, yeah, yeah, like, um, honestly? Uh, you should, um, uh, especially, <laughs> yeah, there you go, yeah, yeah, go for it, <laughs> all right, sir, hey, good to see you, bro, and, uh, yeah, thanks for stopping by, um, uh, yep, looks like Mitch is getting just dunked on here, <laughs> oh, professor, okay. Yeah, and he can't stop us with just Mankey. Okay, another bench Pokemon. That's cool. Um, yeah, we have basically won here. I guess I'll show Ice Beam because, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Man, we got lucky with that seal draw there. So, seal team six, you know, etc. And we got another plus power. So, you know, Mitch didn't really get to strut his stuff in this one either. <laughs> it was just Mitch swept us. We swept him. And then in match three, you know, the tiebreaker match. We swept him, so taste my Aurora Beam, bro. <laughs> but anyway, with that, we have thoroughly defeated Mitch, the club master. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah how's it feel, Mitch? And we won, uh, like, basically five prizes to one. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, we destroyed him.
Ninetales. This card's pretty boss. Like, look at this. Dancing Embers. Flip eight coins, man. Uh, yeah, so potentially for three damage, you could potentially do 80 damage. That's insane. Uh, yeah, 10 for each heads. Most likely you'll get, you know, three or four, which is still good. I mean, three for 40. Pretty good, yeah. Uh, yeah, also mix-up is pretty interesting for an attack. Basically, you um, <laughs> you ruin your opponent's hand, which that could matter. That could win you the game. Because if you take, like, evolution cards out of their hand, they can't evolve into Blastoise, etc. Or Venusaur, or whatever. So. Also, this attack could help them out. <laughs> so... E you know, use with caution. You know, this is a good attack to use in combination with Lass, the trainer card. Yeah. That way you know if you're helping them or hurting them, for sure. You know. Uh, Magnemite. All right. Fire. Electro. Hey, this is our first one. So this has Sonic Boom. Don't apply weakness and resistance. Yeah, I kind of love this attack because there are, like, a slew of brown Pokemon in this game, like Rhydon, and the fact that it ignores resistance, you know, much like, you know, because Sonic Boom in the games does flat 20 damage, and I always liked this GB Electrode, not only for Sonic Boom, because it cuts through resistance, which you kind of need in an electric deck, but also this attack, Energy Spike, yeah, I actually find this the Electrode's best attack. Search your deck for a basic card and attach it to one of your Pokemon. Yeah, you can use this in like multi-colored decks. Like, let's say you're using an Evolution deck and you've got Electric for Jolteon, you've got Water for Vaporeon, and you've got Fire for Flareon. Yeah, this doesn't say you have to search for an Electric Energy. No, you can search for any energy, as long as it's a basic. Pretty good. Yeah, it's costly. Yeah, it doesn't do any damage, but... Especially if it's really early in the game and you're not getting heavy hitted. <laughs> if you're getting hit with like those uh, 1 for 10 attacks like Weedle's Poison Sting <laughs> and their poison's just failing, you know, this can get out of hand really quickly. Why? Because you're attaching two energy per turn and you just kind of sacrifice Electro to summon your summon skull. That's effectively what's happening is like imagine you have Zapdos on the bench and you're attaching two electric energy to it for turn. That's going to get out of hand real fast. And also, this thing has a really cheap retreat cost of one. So I find energy to spike to be like the, the superior strategy. But I guess Sonic Boom does help if you're up against, you know, Marowak and company. So anyway, uh, Magmar. Uh, speaking of Marowak, <laughs> this thing's pretty good. Yeah. Bone Meringue, call for friend. Another gambler, good. Um, and Polyweg, okay. All right, so let's save right here and let's uh, let's edit this deck, the Poison, <laughs> perfectly ultimate Great Moth deck. Yeah, let's just take down an energy. Let's throw in the gambler. Uh, I don't think we. Oh, we are actually full on gamblers here. Good. Okay, in that case, do I have any other trainers? I guess I have Revive, which. <laughs> yeah, the, I also have Item Finder, but I definitely need to throw Item Finder into a deck. Um, maybe I'll throw it into the Psy Splash. Oh, let's see if I had any more comments there. Yeah, that's the thing about GBA is I tend to need to do chat check here. So, oh yeah. And thanks for being here, sir. Appreciate you. <laughs> yeah, sir was here for, and uh, for those of you who don't understand the rice joke, <laughs> yeah, sir was here for like an early morning stream one time and point blank, I just kept going back and forth and having to deal with the rice <laughs> so I was making breakfast. So kind of an inside joke there. If you guys don't get it on the YouTube bot, now you get it. Yeah, I tend to, you know, obviously I stream. So and like I started here first thing in the morning. Did I have breakfast? No. Do I want some rice now? Kind of. <laughs> But we're just going to keep going here. Um, any other good trainer cards? Right, the item finder. Um, yeah, here we go. Okay, so now in this deck, ooh, I really don't want to go lower than that amount of energy. So maybe we take out... Hmm. I think that's what I want to do in this deck is show the Slowbro line once and then take it out. Um, but for now, 
Uh, oops, didn't mean to do that. Let's, uh, for now, let's take out... I can go down a Jinx. Hmm, but I don't want to. <laughs> let's go down a, a Poliwag, I think. Hmm, yeah. Three, two, one. Okay, okay, that, that works, that works. Alright, and let's go with Size Splash Ripple. And here we go. Alright, I'm gonna grab a drink real quick. Alright, and uh, we basically accomplished the goal for this stream. I mean, <laughs> all I wanted to do for the VOD on you guys is uh, literally beat Mitch and just head on out. So, I guess for the next uh, 15 minutes, I'll just do like random duels, but yeah. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can find Imakuni again, actually, I guess. Um, yeah, let's save here. And, oh, right, I guess we can, um, I can show you guys this. Um, so, after you get a club... Master Metal. Feel free to head over to the right here. And yeah, you see these machines. So what you want to do is find the machine that you just want in and insert the metal. So there's the fire, science, uh, grass. It's going to be like the last one we check, isn't it? Ah, uh, this always happens. Um, oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> All right, insert the fighting. And yeah, if you hit build the deck, yeah, these are the decks that the duelist used. Yeah, remember he did battle? If you hit read the instructions, yeah, you can uh, build, uh, I think it was Michael who used this deck. Yeah, you can build his deck. And uh, yeah, the hardest part would be getting these two Kangaskhan. This card is so rare and so good, but Jungle Kangaskhan is a boss sauce. Also, we still don't even have any defenders. Despite dueling Sarah all those times. Uh, battle contest. I think this is Jessica? I'm not sure. But anyway, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, Dragonite? What the? Pretty sure no one used this. Holy smokes. Um, interesting deck, by the way. Um, wow, okay. Um, bench attack deck. So, I don't know if anyone used this either. Interesting. Oh, yeah, the chain lightning. Yeah, this electrode's pretty interesting as well. Uh, yeah, the defending Pokemon isn't colorless. This deck does 10 damage to each bench Pokemon of the same type. Yeah, yeah this is a pretty interesting deck. Um, yeah, and uh, yeah, yeah, I do it go with the Zapdos, the one with Thunderstorm. Yeah, pretty interesting. And then you use him on the Stretch Kick to finish people off. Yeah, this deck's pretty interesting. Uh, maybe we'll try to copy this one at some point, actually. Well, as far as the uh, basic Pokemon. <laughs> If I ever use the deck machine, you'll notice that I copy the basic Pokemon, but the trainer lineup for most of my decks is the same. You know. So yeah, yeah. So, but bench attack that does seem pretty interesting. And like, imagine combining all this bench attack with even a single Gengar. Yeah, like maybe you take me out down to three, include like one Ghastly, one Haunter, one Gengar, and like no energy for him. But all you want is Curse. Yeah. This would be an interesting strategy, for sure. Um, and then all fighting Pokemon. Um, oh, this is just like literally, like literally all fighting. Okay. <laughs> yeah, because they got like every evolution line in here. Okay. okay. So, now, Golem is a house. I don't want to discount that. Also, I never understood why Rhydon resists electric in this game. And it's a rock ground, too. But Golem doesn't. <laughs> That's kind of weird. I've always wondered why that's the case in this game. Uh, same for Onyx. I guess they didn't want to make too many Pokemon, you know, in the first wave that resist electric. They didn't want, like, every, you know, rock ground to resist electric. But I feel like, you know, you should pick one of the two. Either Onyx should have gotten the electric resistance or Golem. Pick one, you know. I guess Onyx. I mean, Onyx is a basic Pokemon. It wouldn't have hurt to just, you know. <laughs> Besides, there's that whole thing in the anime with Rhydon. Pikachu, go for the horn. <laughs> there's that BS, so Rhydon shouldn't resist electric. <laughs> oh, man. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, so we insert the Master Metal right there. Uh, let me check on chat. We're good. Okay. So, uh, yeah, yeah. Game's fun, man. All right. So let's go. Um, yeah, let's just go over here and let me save. Um, now the question is, which club do we want to take on next? Because that's the reality. So I really have all different kinds of decks. Um, uh, you know, let me think about it from this perspective. 
Yeah, I kind of took you guys to Mitch first because, <laughs> you know, he spreads his guys out, therefore forcing you to, like, explore the island, which is good. Um, ooh, wait, one thing I can do here. Don't I get a, uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. There may be a little, uh, scene I can show for you guys. Uh, those in search of the legendary cards. Right. Shall inherit the legendary cards. Okay, not, not, not yet, not yet. <laughs> I remember I actually triggered a little cutscene in there. Um, maybe it's after you get two medals. I don't know. Um, uh, what's the next easiest club to take on? Um, if I'm going to be perfectly honest, I'm thinking about the power of the club masters. Um, hmm, yeah, that's pretty... Well, I'll be honest with you guys. The next easiest club to take on after the fighting... And I wouldn't say the fighting is easy either. Like... Um, yeah, Mitch can be hard, man. Especially if he starts with Hitmonchan, which he never did. Any of our that thing's got 70 HP. That thing's a boss, so... If you're struggling with Mitch and just his raw damage output, you know, yeah, try going against someone else. I'd actually say the next easiest club master is probably in the science club. But let's go over here and just kind of, you know... Oh, there's E. McCooney, perfect. This is who I actually wanted to run into. So, um, I guess next stream, we will... Ooh, I should switch from Slice Splash, yeah. This next week, Psychic 2, so is this. <laughs> it's so weird. Um, mm -hmm. Let's switch to this deck. Let's switch to this deck. All right, and I'll actually make, out of, out of an abundance of caution, let me do this. Because uh, we definitely want to beat Imakuni here, too. Okay. Uh, who who are you? La di da la di da. Yeah, we've heard this before. Let's duel, buddy. Whatever that means. <laughs> All right. All righty, Makuni. Let's do this, buddy. All right. <laughs> All right, Nidoran. That's weak to psychic. Ditto. I should probably go with Ditto. Yeah, let's go with Ditto. Nidoran on the bench. He also has other Pokemon, not just psychic. So. Yeah, I thought Buzz Joey Wheeler. Nice, it is drowsy. So, what's nice is Ditto completely walls. Yeah, both of his psychic Pokemon there, and I'm pretty sure he doesn't have Hypno. So, yeah, because uh, as you see here, uh, <laughs> Ditto resists psychic, which, <laughs> again, like I made this point last stream, and I don't know for the life of me why. They're like, okay, we only have a lineup of three ghosts. Ghastly. Yeah, Haunter. Oh, it's Imakuni card! Your active Pokemon is now confused. Imakuni wants you to play with him as a basic Pokemon, but you can't. A mysterious creature not listed in the Pokedex. He has kids around the world. Who's cuter? Pikachu or me? And all it does is confuses Pokemon. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, man. That's, that's so funny. Um, but yeah, I've always wondered that. They, they Like, who thought of that? They're just like, okay. The only ghost Pokemon we have are Ghastly. The other version of Ghastly, Haunter, the other version of Haunter, and Gengar. You know what we should do? We should make all colorless Pokemon, all of them, all of them resist only those three Pokemon. You know, those six cards. But we have the entire Abra line, we have Kadabra, we have, you know, this line, Drowsy, Hypno, we've got... We've got, uh, what you got? We got Slowpoke, Slowbro. Yeah, let's just have him resist everything. Like, what? No. Ditto does not resist Psy Wave. <laughs> Ditto does not resist Confusion or Confuse Ray. Like, what? No, that makes no sense. Like, I don't, like, like I said, for the life of me, I don't know who made that decision. I don't know why. Like, that, that was like. Out of all the mistakes early Pokemon made, because, you know, every training card game has some mistakes, you know, it's just gonna be, yeah. But, like, yeah, having Ditto, <laughs> and, like, I've said this before, okay, if you are gonna do that, I don't know, make one Ghastly Line resist fighting, because ghosts are immune to fighting, and make one Ghost Line, you know, because they have two versions, make one Ghost Line resist normal. Like... Like, why would you not do that? You know, because, you know, yeah, normal's immune to ghost, but ghost is also immune to normal. It's, it's a, you know what I mean? It's like a symbiotic, it's parallel, it's, 
Yeah, it's equivalent. That's the word I'm looking for. It's equivalent resistance. So it never made sense to me why all colorless Pokemon resist psychic. And then none of the ghosts resist normal. That never made sense to me. It didn't seem balanced, you know. Of course, later Pokemon, you won three times against me. Does that make you happy? Does it? Oh, I don't really want to give you this, but here, take care of it. And we get the Imakuni card. Yeah, guys, this is one of the... Yeah, and in order to complete the card album, you kind of need this card, so... <laughs> yeah, I'm never going to put this in a deck, but... Hey, there you go. And both cards and dance. Sold them, read them, are the secret. Hey, that sounds cool. Maybe I'll become a poet. <laughs> All right, see you, Imakuni. <laughs> What a weird guy. All right, anyway, that takes care of Ian McCooney. And with that, let me see what time we are at. Um, yeah. Looks good to me. Hey, we're at about 55 minutes. That's perfect for a YouTube VOD. So, hey, thanks for joining me, guys. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Uh, you know what? Let's let's try to raid, bro. Like, I doubt anyone's even playing Pokemon the Trading Card game. <laughs> but let's see. Let's take a look online here and... Maybe we'll raid into someone we've never met before. I don't know. <laughs> oh, man. Let's see. Pokemon. Trading card. Yeah, there we go. Pokemon trading card. Boom. All right. Um, Some people are probably playing like the modern. Oh, are they doing a pack opening? Ooh, that sounds interesting. That sounds interesting. Okay. Opening Paradox Rift. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Okay, so some people do, like, live Pokemon card openings. That's awesome. That's awesome, dude. Uh, oh, and someone's having a birthday. It says, Happy Birthday, Vixie. Huh. Well, let's go wish them a happy birthday if they allow raids. Uh, let me minimize Twitch Studio here so I can copy this name. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, so the Twitch name, guys, is No Fox Were Given. Oh, I see, I see. And they've got the, uh, <laughs> that's that's cool, actually. That's cool. That's a cool username. And they've got the uh, Fox Avatar. So let's see if they allow raids. I don't know if they do, but um, yeah, let's go for it. Um, let's see. Do, do, do. Okay. <laughs> but uh, yeah, you guys um, on, on, on uh, YouTube who watch the VOD, because this VOD's going up today. Yeah, be sure to come over to Twitch and uh, say happy birthday to No Fox Were Given. All right. Well, that's going to do it for me, guys. I will see you all next time on Pokemon Trading Card Game. All right. Toodaloo. <laughs> Have a good day, guys. All right. Next time on Pokemon Trading Card Game. All right. The mommy issues that you have are not going to get worse. They may even get better. Which is surprising. Oh. Floodenmon, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in. How are you doing today? I really appreciate it. Welcome in, welcome in. We are doing some. Oh. Thank you so much for the follow too. I really appreciate that. Can we get a shout out for Floodenmon? We're uh, doing some tarot readings, and then we're getting back to opening these 151 packs. <laughs> Not horny. Please just drink, you temptress.